this is the first cat we're going to show you today with the rather unlikely name of Wapageti. He is a long-haired black with kind of that creamy undercoat and big gold eyes. Neutered male, two years old. Was adopted from the shelter as a kitten. Was picked up stray. Returned to his family. And then picked up several days later, miles and miles and miles from his family home, from which we assume that his owner really didn't want him, and they just drove a long way before they dumped him the second time. And it's sad. He's lovely. He's playful. He's beautiful. He gets along with other cats. He is a curious, outgoing, take him home, love him, and keep him, and let him be part of their family. His name is Wapageti, and he is a trip of a love. This beautiful girl is Emily. She is three and a half years old. A uh, beautiful gray and white tabby. Uh, kind of tabby, some smoke gray, some white. She's got it all. She is a cuddler. She's good with kids. She's good with other people. She is not, however, good with dogs, so she needs to go to a house where there are no dogs. She's front declawed. Um, for those of you who prefer a declawed cat, this has been done. And basically, all Emily wants is a loving hand, a shoulder to crawl on, a place to be, and people to love. And that, it seems to me, would be very easy to do because Emily herself is just a little love. You're looking at Big Tom, neutered male, six and a half years old. Huge, beautiful Morris look-alike with lime green eyes that look out at the world with love and I don't know where he finds it in him. Cat was abandoned in a home in an apartment with no food and no water. It was 95 degrees out and Lord only knows what it was like inside. He had a massive cyst on his neck which has been removed and he's still got a little bit of extra flesh there. But they're kind of hoping it will reabsorb, and if not, maybe fix it, but they haven't quite decided. All they know is he is gorgeous. He is loving. He would be an absolutely terrific family cat because he loves to be held, and he loves to be petted, and he only wants one thing in life. Big Tom wants to be loved. The cats you're looking at now are a pair. That's Sherry, who's a two-year-old, short-haired black, spade female, and ditto, eight-year-old, short-haired brown tabby, both two paw declawed. Uh, the cats were abandoned together in a carrier. Somebody just put them in a parking lot and drove away. Didn't think that it was hot, didn't think that it might storm, didn't think that they would be terrified, didn't think much of anything except, well, time to get rid of the cats. And they don't understand why they're here. They're good loving cats. They love each other. They comfort each other. As you can see, they like to cuddle with each other. And they thought they were being the best cats they could be in the home they were at. And I think they thought their people loved them. And maybe their people did and couldn't keep them. But maybe their people didn't care enough to work to find a home for them either. Just leaving them in a carrier on the street is cruel. So they've been through the mill. They are sweet. They are loving. They're a little bit frightened and a little bit shy and need to go home together because they very much depend one upon the other. But that's Sherry, the black one, and that's Ditto, the tabby. They love each other, and they really need someone else to love. Would you like to meet the Muffin Man? The Muffin Man is an absolutely magnificent gray and white, long-haired, front declaw fellow. Uh, very sweet, a little timid till he gets to know you, but then he loves attention and he loves to be brushed. He is, however, our special needs cat because he's diabetic and he's going to need insulin injections. Insulin is not horrendously expensive and giving the injections is not terribly hard. If I could learn to do it, anybody can. And just look at him, he, he, it's not his fault. He needs to be watched, he needs his insulin, he needs to be fed correctly, but more than anything else, he needs to get the heck out of the shelter and into somebody's arms. That's where he's happiest, and all he wants is to be happy. 
This is the Muffin Man. He is absolutely beautiful. He is a snuggly, cuddly, loving boy looking for a forever home of his own.